Royal. Good day, Royal. Good For Uganda People's Defense Forces, UPDF soldiers who escaped the May 26th Al Shabaab onslaught on their base in Somalia and lost contact with comrades in arms say they survived for six days by drinking their own urine. The quartet was found weak but alive, with a lieutenant among them nursing bullet wounds, UPDF and defense spokesperson Brigadier Felix Kulaije said. One soldier at the rank of lieutenant was shot in the leg. He hid near the base and sent his escort to get help. The two other soldiers of lower rank hid near the base and survived on urine as food for six days, Brigadier Felix Kulaiji said. He added the fourth soldier hid a bit far from the base but also survived by drinking their own urine. Following details of the, 20, of the May 26th attack, in which President Museveni, the commander in chief, said Uganda lost 54 soldiers, are emerging in bits after the army launched a counter offensive and recaptured Bulo Maria forward operating base. UPDF's highest ranked officer at the base posthumously identified as Lieutenant Colonel Edward Nyololo from Alua reportedly shot himself dead when it was imminent Al-Shabaab was taking him as a prisoner of war. The army, without specifying the day, said bodies of the fallen soldiers will be flown home this week. The losses suffered when Al-Shabaab fighters overrun the Bulo Maria fob was the worst single incident of the UPDF foreign assignments and the worst since it first deployed in Somalia in March 2007. Citing Pan-African Zim, General Museveni ordered the troops to deploy in the Horn of Africa country without parliamentary authorization or prompt briefing as provided in the constitution and the soldiers have been loaded for expelling the militants from Mogadishu, the capital, and capturing their countryside territories. The May 26th incident has reunited the debate at home, including proposals by four time presidential challenger and former Museveni's Bush time personal physician Dr. Kizabesije and Mr. Mathias Impuga, the leader of the opposition in parliament, that UPDF has overstayed in its welcome in Somalia and its soldiers should, should withdraw to prevent battle held losses from over show shadowing gains over the past 16 years may their souls rest in peace and thank you so much for watching